Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do is start out by getting our veggies ready. So I'm gonna use, do my onion first. I'm just gonna do this onion in rings because in a quiche, it's really not gonna matter and it makes it a whole lot quicker, especially since I'm gonna saute some of these veggies ahead of time a, a little bit, cook them ahead. So let me just, this won't take long to. Slice the onion, It'll, there'll be rings. Drop them into my dish. That was about a, that wasn't really a medium onion. That was a pretty small one. That's why I'm using the entire thing. Plus we're gonna make a eight and a half by 11 size quiche. So we want it to ha be substantial. Okay, there's the onion. Next thing we'll do is my bell pepper. I'm making it colorful, so I'm using an orange bell pepper today. I've already pre-washed the veggies. All I was doing was taking out the innards from the bell pepper. So that it's clean like that. And I wanna get rid of these little seeds. You can eat those seeds, but I don't like them. Hold on one second, I'll be right back. Okay. Now I'm just wanna chop this. And there again, these don't have to be tiny because we're gonna saute this stuff a little. So that is one whole small onion, one good sized, I'd say that was a large bell pepper. You can use as much or as little as you want. But like I say, for this size quiche, I want to have substance. So I want plenty of veggies. It's mainly going to be veggies and cheese. There is going to be some bacon, but not a, not a ton of meat. Now there is cheese, so that, and the eggs, of course, all that is protein. Okay, we got our bell peppers done. So into the mixing bowl it goes. Now we got our onion and pepper in there. We got white and orange. I'm gonna add some red with the red tomatoes. So we'll get this chopped. I'm slicing the little tops off the tomatoes. I know you can eat that, but I don't personally like to eat that. So I just chop it off. These are little cocktail tomatoes. They're a little bit bigger than Roma tomatoes, but they're not as big as just salad tomatoes. So they have lots of flavor, which I love.
We've almost got our veggies prepped. There's the tomatoes. So, in they go. The very last veggie to prep are the mushrooms. They've already started out pre-sliced. So, it ain't gonna take much to get these ready. The other two veggies that are green are, are the spinach and kale. I don't have to do anything with those. I've got organic already ready to use and it's gonna get sauteed with these other veggies on the stove here in the next video, but um, there's, it's, it's sitting on the stove. But you're gonna see my colorful veggie mix in the end that's gonna end up in this quiche. The more color to your meals, the healthier they are. I don't know if you've ever heard this or not, but a lot of health gurus say, eat the rainbow. And what they mean by that is, it's add as much color as you can to your salads and your meals. And most of the color that you can add to your meals will come from your fruits and veggies. So your plants, there's our mushroom. So now it's gotta go in. Okay guys, I got all that food prepped in seven minutes. I'll see you in the next segment.